Well, I regard that as being one of the sort of uh, assumptions which people uh, are trying to make, put two and two together. I, I wouldn't put any uh, reliance on any of these suggestions until the inquiry is, in con is conducted. Test pilots, though, naturally are somewhat proud of their aircraft. Is this something which a test pilot would conceivably do, having witnessed a fine performance by another plane, at least try to equal it or outdo it? I think it's uh, very doubtful. What do you think uh, the inquiry will focus on? What sort of things will they be looking for? Well, there's only one uh, fact which I think probably will be beyond dispute, and that is that the aeroplane uh, did come apart before it hit the ground. So uh, people will obviously be looking for some form of uh, failure within the aeroplane, whether it's uh, a failure of the systems or whether it's a failure of structure. I don't know. There does seem to be an explosion from the film. Did that tell you anything looking at no, it? No, it doesn't tell anything at all because uh, an explosion can be an explosion in the sense of the word that most of us would understand, or if, for instance, uh, there is a major structural failure on an aeroplane, it, it's the equivalent of an explosion. The result's the same. What do you think the conceivable effect could be on the Concorde project itself? Any at all? I don't think it has any effect whatsoever.